Hi, in this video, uh, I will explain shift operator in Java. So in Java, we are having three type of shift operator. So one, and this is known as la uh, left shift. Uh, this is uh, left shift, right shift, and one is right shift with zero field. So this is the right shift with zero field. So this is left shift operator denoted by less than two less than symbol and this one is right shift and this is denoted by two greater than symbol and this is again same right shift with right shift filled with zero so we will see how this shift operator works so for example, if you want to see the working of left shift operator, I am taking a variable a and I am assigning this value 2. And I want to see what is the output if I shift this value in left side 1. So this is the first operand when we use left shift. And this is the number of shift you uh, we want to perform. So we want to shift only 1. So every bit of this number will be shifted in left side. So if you will see binary of 2. So we are using a calculator application here. So, so binary. This is the binary of 2. And in case uh, if you want to see the binary in 32 bit. So these are the 32 bit. All bits are 0 and only the bits are 1. 0. So when we perform left shift, it means every bit will be shifted in its left side. It means this 0 will be shifted at one's position, 1 will be shifted here, 0, 0. So every and this 0 will be out. So after one shifting, what we will get? We will get after one shifting, we will get this number. Why? Because uh, uh, previously this bit 1 was here after one shifting this one is shifted in its left side so if we will see the decimal of this value which is 4 so if we <coughs> execute our program so say java c ex dot java <coughs> so here the <coughs> answer is 4 so region left shift it will shift every bit in its left side so if you see the previously our number is 2 and result we are getting 4 so now if we perform here twice shifting it means uh, after one shifting 2 will be 4 which is this one and again if we perform one more shifting here so this one bit will come at fourth position and this 0 will come at 3rd, this 0 will come at 2nd and a new 0 will be introduced. So the new number will be 1, 0, 0, 0. This will be the number after shifting and if you will see the decimal, this is 8. So if we again compile our program, run it, so answer is 8. So it means every left shift will double the number. Initially we were having 2. This number become 4 after performing one shift, one left shift. When we performed again, one more shift, 4 become 8. So now if we perform one more shift on this one, if we uh, shift this number in left side 3 times, this number will be 16. So in every left shift, our number will be get doubled. Okay. Now, uh, we want to see right shift. So uh, okay, before going for right shift, we have to uh, uh, understand here one thing that whatever num uh, the size of integer variable in Java is 32 bit. And so these are the representation of 32 bits. So if we are performing a left shift, the maximum number of shift we can perform is 32. This is the maximum number. It means here if we are writing any number greater than 32. For example, say I want to shift this number by 33. 
and I am having a 2. So now what it will do? What will happen? So in Java this is the concept. The maximum uh, shift possible in Java on integer is 32 and if we are performing 33. So what it will do? If you will see the binary of 30 <coughs> 33. So it needs 6 bits left shift right shift right shift filled with zero they all only will take these first five bits of the second operand doesn't matter which value you have specified you have specified a negative number or positive number so <coughs> so here we have provided 33 so if you want to calculate the answer of this one it means it will take only 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. It means uh, for performing 0, 0, 0, uh, if we, so the number, this 33 actually uh, is represented as 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. This is the binary of 33. Now only these 5 bits will be taken for performing left shift on A and if you see this 5 bit this is the binary of 1 so if you will see the output of this program we will compile it we will execute it so answer is 4 why instead of <coughs> going for 33 shifting only 5 bits are taken which is 1 so this number will be shifted in left side only one time same also same concept will be applied using negative value as well say for example if I am taking a negative value minus 1 2 3 4 so this is the say minus 1 2 3 4 5 and now I want to see what is the output so first of all we will see the binary of minus 1 2 3 so we will use this calculator application in programmer mode this is minus 1 2 3 4 5 now we will see the binary of this number so this is the binary of minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So left shift, this shifting operator only use first 5 bits. So if we see here first 5 bit 0, 0, 1, 1, 1. So this 0, 0, 1, 1, 1. So these 5 bits will be used as a second operand here. And this is the, <coughs> if you will, uh, we want to see what is the decimal of this one. So zero zero one 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 triple one. So this is the decimal of seven. So this is equivalent to seven left side shifting. <coughs> so if we see the answer of this shift, so we are getting two fifty six. So how we are getting that uh, answer? So this actually equivalent to 7 because only 5 bits are taken for shifting operation and 5 bits of minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 are forming number 7 and in every shift our number get doubled so in first shift 2 become 4, second 8, third shift 16, fourth shift 32, fifth shift 64 sixth if we are performing sixth shift it will be uh, 128 uh, okay uh, if we, okay use we will use the calculator again for the same thing so we are uh, so seven time left shift in every shift the number get doubled so we can see say this uh, two to the power seven in so if we multiply 2 after first shift it will be doubled it will become 4 uh, wait uh, this is to multiply wait wait what is 2 multiply this first shift we performed 4 second shift 8 third shift 16 fourth shift 32 fifth shift 
64 sixth shift 128 and seventh shift you will get 256 so that's why the answer is 256 so left shift right shift or right shift will be 0 second operand whatever you are giving a negative number or greater than 32 only first 5 bits are taken for shifting operation so now we will see the right shift operator so here we are taking say 7 mm, or okay, so first uh, take 8 uh, a 8 and then we will perform here right shift and 1 so how this right shift works we will so we want to see the binary of 8 so this is the binary of 8 here 32 bits 0 0 0 and last 4 bits are 1 0 0 0 right shift says that <coughs> every bit will be shifted to its right position so it means this one will come in its right position which is third position this zero will come here this zero will come here and the last zero will be out now here this zero when shift here it will create a empty space in the uh, leftmost position and this empty space will can be filled with zero or one so now first we are taking here example of 8 where we are having 0 0 0 so when we perform one shifting this one will come here and the number this number is 1 0 0 and which is 4 so if we see the execution of this program 4 so our number actually become half so right shift operator uh, right shift operation this right shift operator will make our number half now if we want to see the right shifting operation on minus 8 so what it will be now so let's uh, first uh, see here we are having 8 minus 8 now we want to see the binary so this is the binary of minus 8 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 0 0 so this is the binary of minus 8 now now here if we perform right shifting it means every bit will come at right position so this one will come at third position this zero will be out this last one will be shifted here and it will create a empty space so now so how our number will look like uh, it will be one 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 say a width so when this one will be shifted here this empty space will be filled with one in the previous case when we were having eight that empty space is filled with 0 but now we are having a negative number so that empty space will be filled with 1 so the reason is right shift operation how it works it will see the last digit this digit if this is 1 the newly filled bit will be 1 if this is 0 newly filled bit will be 0 so this is minus bit we want to perform uh, right shifting so everything will come in its right so we will be having last two bit as zero and then everything one 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 so if we uh, check the binary for 16 minus 16 uh, not minus 16 sorry uh, if we check the binary of minus 4 so this binary 4 is the result of right shifting over the minus 8 and if you will see the output of this program it also will say minus 4 because in Java negative number are stored using 2's complement so this is the right shift so for right shift you need to remember two things uh, the <coughs> newly filled bit depend depends on 
left most bit so in minus 8 we were having one as its left most bit so newly filled bit will be 1 in case of 8 it will be 0 <coughs> now uh, last we want to see the difference between this one and this one so on minus 8 we have performed one right shifting now we are performing one right shifting right shift filled with zero so now what it will do so how it works hmm. let first have binary minus 8 which is 1 1 1 1 1 and at last triple zero so when we perform one right shifting this one will come here this one will come here this last one bit will be shifted at second last position and it will create an empty space here so this operation this operator will fill this last position by zero so if we see the output of this program <coughs> this is a huge number and if we actually see the binary of this number so this binary will be same as this one uh, with the change like 0 0 1 1 1 1 1 and at the end it will be 0 so let's uh, see the binary of this one mm, 2 1 4 7 4 8 3 6 double 4 now let's see the binary so this is the exact uh, uh, wait uh, okay it's not showing the last zero so actual binary is this one in the 32 bit so this is the binary after performing right shift field with zero on minus eight because the new space the new empty position is filled with zero doesn't matter this is number a positive or negative this will be filled with zero and the fourth in the case of minus eight a one on fourth position is shifted at three positions so this number is the result of this one so right shift filled with zero and right shift the difference between these two right shift operation it will fill the empty position uh, on the basis of sign if the number is positive it will be filled with zero if the number is negative this will be filled with one but this operation it will always fill the new empty position with zero so this is the way how left shift right shift and right shift filled with zero operation works you need to remember the possible number of shifting can be possible is 32 bit 32 shifting 32 shifting so if you are specifying any number beyond 32 or if you are specifying any negative number only five bits five left most bit will be considered for the shifting operation thank you very much